This is Codedorg. Let's see what we have here. You've been given a new cell phone with a 2 gigabyte data plan. Ooh. Uh, you plan to use your phone for text messages, images, video, and music. All right. Which of these categories are best compressed using lossless compression? Which of these categories are best compressed using lossless compression? Okay, guys, a few things. Don't overthink this. Lossless compression means no data is lost. You are taking every teeny tiny bit and making sure it gets to where it needs to be. That's really important for important information. I would say, and I'm just kind of brainstorming this out, text, right? Your words, you want to be exact, right? So also text comparatively takes up teeny, teeny, teeny amount of data. Whereas a video takes up an immense amount of data. It's thousands, millions, trillions, well, not trillions, but a lot of images one after another in high definition constantly. Whereas text is just text. It's just black and white or whatever screen, uh, whatever font color you have enabled on your phone. But it's a really small data size and really easy to transfer directly. So in terms of lossless, there would be no reason to compress text, right? There's no reason to use lossy compression on that. Why waste the time? Text is already itty bitty. The things that you want to consider, and what I love about this question is there's not really a right answer. So you want to think about this. Lossy, I would say almost always you're going to want to do video there, right? Because if you miss four pixels in one of the frames of a video, is it going to wreck the video? No. But are you going to slow down your entire network by making sure every teeny tiny little piece of data gets there? Yeah. Also, you're going to use up your cell phone plan having exact high definition videos when it's a smaller screen, the video could be compressed, you're really not going to notice anyways. You would want the videos likely to be compressed. So lossy is great compression method for videos. You get the content, you're able to see it, you probably can't tell the difference, and it is technically compressed. The, the ones that are definitely going to be more debatable, I would say, are music or audio. And um, images, nowadays I would normally, guys, say images for this here too. And that's just because images are such high quality, uh, large files for our phones right? However, if you're just sending them over SMS or things of that nature, uh, or if you're just sending them over text message, they will be of lower quality. But what you really want to compare or think about is what do you need? What do you have to make sure is of the absolute highest quality? And then what's maybe less important to do so? So I would probably do for this images and uh, audio. I'm not, mm, audio isn't a ton of data i might throw audio up here but again as long as you understand lossless means it's going to be exact it has to transfer all of it lossy means you're going to lose some of it but it can be pretty good and the trade-offs for that you're good to go think of, think it out plan your answer accordingly and argue it well cool onward